Aditya is asking, by any chance, a self-referential canonical can override an existing canonical or preferred page. I believe two canonicals for the same page should be avoided. That's correct. Avoid multiple rel canonicals with separate URLs on the same page. Ankit is asking if putting the date and the month in URLs is OK, and will it affect my Google rankings? Well, having the date in a URL is fine. It doesn't affect crawling, indexing, or ranking of the page. A question from Jay Lowe is, I heard that using CDNs to deliver images might be a problem for Google Search, since it's not on my server, and Google doesn't support image canonicalization. Well, using CDNs for images is fine. It doesn't have to be on your server. Rahul's question is, what is the best way to peer in search if you have a global audience to target with a single domain? We don't have multiple physical addresses for local SEO, and we don't want to go for CCTLDs because of a resource crunch. It's fine to have a single domain. Many websites just have one version that's globally available. RMW Web Publishing is asking, is it such a bad thing to leave the Google Webmasters verification file out of the sitemap XML? We would have thought the sitemap XML should only be filled with content greatness you want indexed. Well, you're right. You don't need to include the verification file in your sitemap file. The verification file is just for Search Console. Nobody else can do anything useful with it. <laughs>